Good morning, everybody. Uh, hope everyone's having a good day so far. Um, what I want to show you in this video is another um, feature that was added to Lumion 11, and it's going to be the satellite maps uh, for the OpenStreetMap. Uh, the reason why I wanted to actually showcase this is because I was playing around with it last night, and I did have a little bit of trouble at first getting it set up, um, just because there are a couple of small things that you have to do uh, for it to work uh, with the new features in Lumion 11. Uh, it doesn't take very long at all, but it's just something that I think is worth pointing out. So what we're going to do first is just open up a blank file or uh, whatever file you want to use. We're going to go to the OpenStreetMap. We're going to turn it on. So this is all normal. Um, but now you're going to see that the I, I don't think the height maps were in there before. Maybe they were. Um, I didn't actually use that this much uh, without the satellite maps, but I probably will be using it now uh, because I think it's a great uh, feature. But regardless, we're going to click these two on. So if we zoom up a little bit more, as you can see, now we have a rough height map and a rough uh, satellite image. Um, now, if we want to, uh, if we want to have like a place in like downtown Halifax here, like something in the south end, I'm going to crank this up to 2.5. So now we get this whole range. So as you can see, we're going to get building information uh, for all this. So what I'm going to do then is I'm going to say, okay, that looks like the area that I want. I'm going to start to download, and this will just take a moment. Um, I think it took like maybe like a minute before. Um, but yeah, see, the, the problem I always have with OpenStreetMap is as cool as this information was, I, I just felt like I couldn't do anything with this on like a high level um, because like the colors are just so unrealistic. Um, and yeah, it just it wasn't really my cup of tea. But um, the satellite maps fix that for the most part because you can... Um, you can just get a little more context with a satellite image and it does look a little bit better. Um, and so you can make uh, pretty decent um, renders now in like less than five minutes um, that will just kind of show uh, where the building is in the city. And like for, for that kind of thing, it doesn't have to be perfect. Like these uh, white blocks will work for that. Um, is that it's really only to give an idea of where you are. So we now what you can see here um, water, land use, earth, roads, building, and satellite. So if we turn that off, obviously we can see the satellite going, but we want to keep that. The buildings, we're obviously going to keep those because that's like the most important thing. Um, but we're going to get rid of land use, roads, and earth. And then this is what you're left with. Now, the water is not as important to get rid of, but I normally just get rid of it too because then you get some more information kind of around the edges of the water. Um, and then, yeah, so what you're left with is this. And if you threw like a little style onto it, then, um, you know, it's, it's extremely quick to do that. And I'll just kind of show you what I was talking about with the concept. So uh, if we uh, if we wanted to put like a little factory here or something like that, what you'd be able to do is you just go to content library and I'll just make sure I don't block this here. Uh, we're going to go to outdoor. And then we're just going to find, oh, maybe we just put an apartment block here. So I'll just twist that in. And uh, yeah, we just twist that in. Maybe I'll make it a little bit bigger. And then, um, yeah, you just kind of find the camera angle that you like. So I think that's pretty good. Uh, maybe just turn the sky a little bit. And we can render that out. And um, yeah, as I mentioned, it's, a, it's extremely quick to do it like that. Now, mind you, you can put your own building on here, whatever it is, uh, but it does give a really good idea of where your um, building location is going to be inside of a city. Um, it doesn't have to be pretty. Um, as long as you have good renders kind of up close, then it's, I think it's acceptable to give a client this level uh, a kind of quality, just because as I said, the, the, the purpose of this is not necessarily to look good, but it's for information. Um, and I think that with the, the satellite view, even if it is a little bit blurry, um, I think it's a really awesome feature and I'll, I'll definitely be using it in the future. So um, I just wanted to uh, thank everyone who subscribed to the channel and has been checking out the videos. Uh, if you're not already subscribed, I'd really appreciate it if you could hit that uh, subscribe button for me. Uh, it would help me out with the YouTube algorithm. Uh, I do plan on releasing uh, quite a few more Lumion 11 new feature tutorials uh, today and tomorrow. So uh, stick around and uh, tune into those. Uh, but for now, uh, I'm off and I will see you guys in the next one.